Um, Christopher, are you ready? Yeah. Okay, Christopher, go ahead. Tell us what happened. And then Cecilia, Tamarian, and Jay, you're listening to if you agree or disagree. Okay, Christopher, go ahead. The girl's feeling nervous. Be because because she because she's going against fifth grader. Fantastic. So she's going against fifth graders in a spelling bee. Okay, so let's see. Cecilia, Jay, and Tamari on thumbs up, uh, thumbs to the side, thumbs down, or build on. Let me see. Got one thumbs up from Cecilia. Tamari, can you put it just a little bit higher so I can see, sweetheart? Thumbs up, thumbs up. Okay, we got everybody as a thumbs up. I love it. All right. Okay, fantastic, Christopher. She, um, Finn smirked at her because he thinks she's gonna win. And, um, uh, uh, um, Jasmine thinks that she might be, she may be win. Okay. Jasmine, I'm sorry to spell her name. Okay, Jasmine thinks she might win. And you said that Finn smirked at her because why? Because he thinks that he will win. Finn smirked at her because he thinks he will win. Okay, so Finn smirked at Jasmine because he thinks he will win, and Jasmine thinks that she might win. So let's go back to the text. And then go ahead and tell me on these two pages if you agree that's what happened, you disagree that's what happened, or maybe you agree with one part but not all of it. Good, I can see Christopher's rereading before he decides. Okay, so Christopher, you disagree. So I'm coming to Christopher one more time. Christopher, why do you disagree that Finn smirked at her because he thinks he will win and Jasmine thinks she's gonna win? Because Jasmine, Jasmine is anxious because she bullied someone that- Okay, Christopher, I gotta pause you for a second. I gotta pause you, sweetheart. You're saying some fantastic things, but you're telling me what you're thinking right now. And I'm trying to figure out if you agree with what somebody else said. So here's what we're gonna do right now, my friends. If Finn smirked at Jasmine because he thinks she can win, but Jasmine thinks she's going to win, well, just show me your text evidence. So right now, reread pages 9 and 10 and show me the evidence where it says that Finn smirked and he thinks he will win. Okay? Go ahead and reread pages 9 and 10. Okay, Cecilia, I'm going to unmute you for a second because I saw your face do this. Why were you doing that? I accidentally missed a part, so I put, I said that he was right. Okay, so where do you see the evidence, sweetheart, that says Finn smirked and Finn thinks he will win? Do you see it on the page? I see it in a picture, but I don't see it in the words. Fantastic. So let's take ourselves back here for a second. And everybody, are we focusing on the text or are we focusing on the pictures? Everybody tell me. Yes, I saw Christopher say the text. I saw Jay say the text. Okay, so we have to go back to the text. So Cecilia, do you see anywhere in the text where it says that Finn smirked and Finn thinks he will win? No. You don't see it. Let me see here. Um, Tamarian, do you see anywhere where it says that? No. Okay. Christopher, do you see where it says it? No. Okay. And Jay, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Okay. Fantastic. All right. So well, if there's no evidence, we have to take that part out if there's no evidence. So let's get back and let's have every single person reread this page, every single person inside your head. And then I'm going to call on somebody to retell it. Go ahead. Okay, my friends. So I see that everybody's finished reading these pages. So let's go back to where we are. Okay. So I'm taking us back all the way up here to yesterday. So yesterday, or I'm sorry, the last time we were together, there was a spelling bee. 
Finn spelled a word wrong, Jasmine spelled the same word correctly in another word. Jasmine felt confident because she was the spelling bee winner in her class. Then later she's being a bully, she's being arrogant, and then Jasmine had to go with the older students and she's worried that she might lose, and then Josh, who's older, says he's gonna win, and now Jasmine is feeling nervous, okay, because she is going against fifth graders. So now we have to know what happened after that in your own words. Um, let's go ahead, Cecilia, we haven't heard from you yet. So what happened next, sweetheart, in your own words? Jasmine was anxious because she didn't practice for the, well, she didn't hear her say the spelling bee words. Okay, so Jasmine is anxious because she didn't practice and she didn't even hear who? She didn't even hear who? She didn't hear the principal when she said what word she would spell. Okay, when she said the words. Okay, so let me know. Do you guys agree or disagree? Show me your thumbs up to the side or down. Let me see. I got one thumb up. Let me see. Tomorrow I see your face, but I can't see your thumb, sweetheart. Get lifted up. Okay, thumbs up, thumbs. Okay, so we got two thumbs up, one thumb to the side. The so, do you think that the whole thing's not in the text? No. You think it's not in the text? Is that right? You think say no, it's not in the text? No. It's not okay, in well, the let's figure it out. So, is there evidence that Jasmine didn't practice, and is there evidence that she's not even hearing or listening when the principal's saying the words? Go ahead, take a look. Give me a thumbs up when you know. Christopher, I'm coming to you because you have a thumbs up. Are you saying you found some evidence? Yeah. That proves what Cecilia said? Yeah. Read it. Principal Lopez started to explain the rules for the spelling bee, but Jasmine wasn't listening what kinds of words she had to spell. Okay, so let's try. Oh, keep going, sweetheart. Keep going. I probably should have studied the word list Mr. Russell gave the class. She thought. Okay, so now I'm going to go to Tamarion and I'm going to go to Jay. Does this evidence right here? When Principal Lopez started to explain the rules, Jasmine's not listening, I probably should have studied the word list. Does that evidence prove that Jasmine's anxious because she didn't practice the words and she didn't even hear the principal? Give me a thumbs up. Good, all right, cool. So Tamarion's like, no, actually there is evidence for that. Okay, let's keep it moving, no problem. Tamarion, go for it, sweetheart. One or two sentences, tell me what happens. So, what happened is that Jasmine try to spell the word caterpillar and she and she was ner she was nervous because she thinks that she might get get it wrong wrong. Fantastic, okay. Um Tamari on fantastic. Uh Christopher, what would you add to that? Add that that she got the word wrong, and then when she tried to sneak back, I'm gonna stop you right there. You're doing a great job, but you're going to the next page. So you got that she got the word wrong. Does everybody agree that she got the word wrong? Thumbs up if you agree with that. Tamara, let me know what you're thinking. Okay, cool. Okay, Christopher. Now I'll let you pick up. What did you want to add now? Jasmine, mm -hmm. we returned to her chair, and then they announced that he was wrong, and then when Jasmine tried to sneak backstage, she, the, the person she bullied stopped her. Okay, so let me see. Jasmine tried to sneak backstage, but the person she bullied stopped her. So let's take a look at this right here. Um, with that highlighted in yellow, who agrees with that and who disagrees with that?
Cool. Okay, we have one to Marianne. Show me what you're thinking. I can't really see. Okay, so everyone agrees that she tried to sneak backstage, but the person she bullied stopped her. Okay, fantastic. So then find evidence for it. Reread this. As soon as you find the evidence that said she tried to sneak backstage, but the person who bullied her stopped her, put a thumb up. One second, sweetheart. Okay, you should be ready to go. I don't think it makes sense because it says she opened the classroom door and she didn't go to the backstage. Okay, so what Celia is saying is this says classroom door, classroom door. So, Tamaria, do you want to fix this really quickly? Jasmine tried to sneak what? Try to sneak in the classroom. And where? Yeah, she tried to sneak into her classroom. Okay, so my friends, we are going to stop right there. And I want, I want you to look at this really quickly. We used nervous, anxious, and then we used nervous again, which is fantastic. Let me go back to our words. Could anybody ashamed. use this word? Ashamed. So think about this yes. for a second. Yeah, I love it. I love it. I love it. So each person get your answer in your head, okay? Who might be feeling ashamed and why? When you feel bad about yourself because of something you did. All right, I'm gonna ask each one of you. So quick answers. Christopher, what do you think? I think she's ashamed for bullying Finn. Okay, so you think who, Jasmine? Yeah. Okay, Jasmine feels ashamed for bullying Finn, right? Okay, let me see. Tamarian, what do you think, sweetheart? I think Jasmine is ashamed because oh, what she did to Finn was wrong. Ooh, I like that you just added on. She feels ashamed for bullying and shit. And what she did to Finn was wrong. I like that addition, Tamarian. It's fantastic. Cecilia, anything that you would add about the word ashamed? Um. No, that pretty much covers it, right? Do you agree with what they're saying? Okay, so fantastic. So we got this word ashamed in there too, which is